I'm a curious person and a lifelong learner that's up for just about anything. And this world is full of people that know how to do some really cool stuff. Each episode, I have just one week to go from total beginner to, well, at least to the point that I won't embarrass myself. I'm Aaron Watkins, and I'm game to learn it all. I got this. Just give me a week. Today's challenge, swing dance. Now swing dance is a group of dancers that developed with the swing style of jazz from the 1920s to the 1950s and includes such dancers as the Lindy Hop, the Lindy Charleston, and something called the Balboa. With the help of a few experts and a whole lot of practice, I'm going to try to get to the point where I can perform on Friday without making a complete fool of myself. Here we go. I'm meeting up with my swing dance teacher, Jenny. She is the founder of Brooklyn Swings. I'm nervous, excited, and what's that I'm hearing? Swing music? Hey. Hey. How today, Jenny? You made it. I made it. Oh. All right. OK, I'm absolutely loving the space, mm -hmm. God and everything. Mm -hmm. OK. Can you tell us a little bit about Brooklyn Swings and exactly how long you've been swinging? So Brooklyn Swings has been going for about four or five years. I've been swing dancing though since 2000, so it's been about 15 for me. Can you tell us a little bit about swing dance and about the history and where it comes from? A lot of it got going around 20s, 30s, and 40s. Most of the dancing that we do today got really popular around those decades. This is a really nice community to come in for most people. There's, a, it's a really comfortable environment and you meet a lot of people. Now what exactly am I going to learn today? You're going to learn so many things, but I got to tell you from the start, you're wearing the right shoes. I'm impressed. What is just some of the fundamentals? There's a lead. So there's a lead and there's a follow. Did she say a lead and a follow? I'm already in over my head. In this round, you're going to be the lead. Interacting with someone else, uh, that just brings a whole nother level uh, to dancing that I'm not used to. All right, something that is like fundamental with this dance is mm. this pulse. Okay. Every step that we do, you're always going to do this. Even if I'm just standing here and I'm just having a drink or something? Yep. Okay, just... Exactly. You're showing the band that you hear them live. I hear you, baby. I no? hear you. I hear just you. like talking. this. Okay. So let's go forward. Okay. And then back. All right. Forward. So put your whole body over a foot. Oh, okay. Yeah? Whole body over the front. Whole body. Okay, I see. Yeah? I'm just swinging a little That's bit. That's a more. choice right now. That's okay, a choice just, right okay. now. So pulse check. Pulse check. Yes. New, new step. Okay. You're gonna take that front foot and we're gonna go back. We'll just go back okay. front, back front. You're doing a rock step. Okay, this is a rock step, ladies and gentlemen. There you go, pro. <laughs> okay. So, pulse, check, rock step, check. check. Yeah? We're only gonna do one of those. Okay. New step. All right. You're okay. a pro already. We're on to step three. Three. Yep. Try this out. Ba, 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 ba. That's okay, you're just gonna try it and then I'll break it down. So this is called I'm a good triple when step. You're here. Every time we go one way, that's a triple. When we go we back doing, the other way, we're going three steps. One, two, three, and four. Oh, it's yeah. still like four. Oh, it's three. He's totally got pulse. He actually really has those triples, and sometimes the triple step can be really tricky for people. This time, what we're gonna do is we're gonna do a send out. On that first triple, you're going to put my back in that direction. Okay. okay. And I do that, I just push you? The reason how you do it is it's like, like pretend like you have a, a plate of cookies. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah? No, 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 you, those cookies will like fall off over oh, there. No. Yeah, yeah? Okay. I'm gonna like serve the cookies. Serve the cookies, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. yeah, it's like, hey, would you like some cookies? Yeah, okay. yeah? The cookies are me, don't break my cookies. Five, six, ready, and rock, step, triple, yes. Oh, okay. Yes. Oh, and it kind of just yes. pushes it forward and it's like. Yes, in this very guiding sort of way, okay. right? Push is like this. No, 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 no. Five-year-olds don't like that, but guiding. So I'd say what keeps people most successful on the dance floor is keeping pulse, keep smiling, and keep moving your body. It just really inspires me, but I am totally afraid to do it. So what we're gonna do? You're gonna go rock, step, go in front, back it up. Yes. Yeah, try yes. it out. Five, six, ready, and rock, step, go in front, back it up, yes. Send out, check. Okay, send out, check. Booyah! <laughs> in your face. No, I gotta get excited, because if I don't get like, For positive sure. reinforcements, I'm just gonna leave out of here, like this is no way it's gonna happen. And next week, I'm gonna be too scared to show up, and they're gonna be calling me like, where are you at? Within that short amount of time, He's got a lot more than he thinks he has. If I can get myself to swing dance, 
that I might be a swinger for life. This is called a side pass, but think of that as like checking your watch. But you're gonna check your watch as you go past your partner, so I'm gonna be you okay. for right now. I'm gonna go rock, step, I'm gonna check my watch, and I'm gonna triple back. Let's do this slow. Okay. Five, six, ready, and rock, step, check your watch, oh. but stay connected to stay me. Connected. Five, six, ready, and rock, step, Triple and triple and rock step. That was it. What I'm like a little worried about with him would be confidence. Because if his confidence goes down, then it's just gonna be like, I don't know what I'm doing. And then who knows what's gonna come out of that. You mentioned before we started that you've done some dancing yourself. Like you've done yeah. some solo dancing before, right? I, I, I do like to dance. You know, back in the day, you used to do the snake and everything. That was like my first dance. The cabbage patch. Oh, you know, oh cabbage yeah. Patch. Now I do the wop. Mm. You gotta do the wop. You gotta do the percolator. <laughs> you gotta do the percolator. I will tell you they you do, do this percolator. in swing. They do. <laughs> okay, so they do that in swing too. Oh yeah. So I can percolate. You can percolate in this on the dance. dance floor. Oh yes, you can. All right, don't tell anybody my secret move, but I might just have to break That's it down. That's your pocket move. I might just have to. That's pop. your pocket move. Are there any other secret moves maybe that I can do? Maybe? Oh, you've seen this one, right? So in this community, we call this crazy legs or oh, breezy crazy knees. Legs. Either, okay. either way. So how do I do the Charleston or something or the Lindy Hop? What was one step, of that? Step, step. See, this back, is the kid and play. Back, yeah. You know I mean? And then you like bring it back to the eighties and put your swivel in, right? That's yeah, and your little hot top and everything. Yeah, exactly. And everything. You know what? I can't teach you anything because you already know. But I'm gonna practice and I'm gonna have a good time this week. I'm just gonna have fun with it and I'm gonna work this out. Okay, that class was awesome. Definitely a lot to think about. Unfortunately, Jenny's not available the rest of the week. So she's sending one of her instructors, Morgan, to help me in a few days. But for now, I'm on my own. They say it takes six months to a year to become an expert at something. This is day two and I'm determined to make it happen in just a few more days. Six days to go, and it's practice, practice, practice. Practice is the key. I got this, I think. So I'm here at Brick House Studios practicing in the corner, but I thought it would be the perfect place to practice because I am in the swing space. Check it out. Swing space. So this is called a triple step. This is the triple step? Triple step. This is I think I'm just going to take this space over here in the corner to practice for a little while. Uh, maybe there's somebody in the building that can swing dance. So before I get on my feet, I thought it would be good to review some of the moves Jenny showed me. It's going to be interesting practicing without her. But I'm at this point, I'm willing to recruit anybody who can help me out. Hey, you, do you know how to swing dance? No, I'm serious. My dad. You do you know how to swing yet? Kind of. Do me a favor and help me out for a second. All right. No, really, come on. Oh my gosh, thank you so much. They said like hold like a okay, cup of coffee. Yeah, okay. Yeah. okay. okay. All right. And we're gonna do a rock step okay. and then triple, triple, and rock step, okay? Right. I just need to get the basics All down right. pat. You ready? Okay. Thank you. Mm -hmm. One, two, three, four. It just so happens that Diane knows a little something about swing step. dance, meaning a lot. Mm -hmm. And she's been kind enough to show me a thing or two. So do you come here often? <laughs> Every day. <laughs> oh, we did that! Did you see that? Did you no, see that? Like that was like natural. I felt it. It was. It's like we swing dance. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. There's space for me. Hopefully, Morgan will be able to stop by and give me a few pointers because uh, Friday is quickly approaching. Does anyone know how to swing dance? Okay, so Morgan from Brooklyn Swings is here to give me a few more tips. Home isn't exactly set up for swing dancing, so I'm moving a few things around. Also, my camera crew wasn't available, so I'm doing some of the recording on my iPhone. Once you get through knowing the steps, it's infectious. Morgan gave me some good advice confirming what Jenny already mentioned. One, keeping pulse with your body. And two, the importance of shifting weight. I'm still concerned about the lead versus follow part though. Morgan suggested I take a look at swing dance videos online. Hopefully, that will help me too. I think you're gonna do great. I'm on your team. All right, go team. Yeah. Team Aaron. Aaron. 
Sometimes you have to improvise. My cameraman here, Thomas, he's effing awesome behind the camera, but today he's in front of the camera teaching me a thing or two. So make sure you pay attention. If I spin you like as I'm leading you, mm -hmm. then I will switch hands. Oh, so I'm supposed to switch hands? Yeah, lead switch his hands. Yes, okay, all right. That makes sense now, just saying. Yeah. All right. Rock step. Boom, 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 boom. And then we can live here. It's, I'm not, I'm, uh, it's the opposite side. Boom, boom, boom. But if you get off, boom. Totally fine. Oh, you're opposite. That's right, because you're supposed to lead. Yeah. That's okay. I'm confused right now. Look, show me the handwork. Boom. So then we'll keep going. Back. Rock step, jump step, jump step. And then we're going to start going slow, boom. just so we can go into this. So as we go into this, we're going to start one, two, three. Mm -hmm. And then we go one, two, three. I'm going to switch hands. And then rock step, triple step, triple step. Oh, and then we're oh. back into it. And you're back into it. Thomas was great. That's my man. He helped with improvisation, a big part of being a good swing dancer. You need to touch the shoulder and do a graze down the arm. Uh -huh. Oh, I said, yeah. <laughs> you have really pretty eyes. You. <laughs> Okay, so honesty time. I love to dance, and when it comes time to partner dance with somebody, I run for the hills. So, no more running. It's time to partner up, time to lead, grab my swing dance partner, and do -si do Come hella high water, we are gonna dance on Friday. Day seven is finally here. To be quite honest with you, I think I still kind of suck. Uh, swing dance is definitely a dance that should be rehearsed with a partner. Uh, but from everything I've seen online, if you know your basics and you recognize that it's an improvisational dance and you go out and have fun, then uh, yeah, if you fail, fail big. And uh, it's time to have some fun. Wish me luck. Every morning, that would get me up out of bed. Every month, Brooklyn Swings hosts a swing dance social where dancers of all levels get to show off what they can do. This month's social also features Gabby Galore and the Sugar Shakers and includes Morgan as well. The Sugar Shakers is a dance group specializing in swing era moves, cabaret, and vintage entertainment. Dressing in period appropriate clothing, they perform all around the city, and boy, do they know how to get this swing dance party started. Wow, they're good. I mean, really good. Am I gonna be judged by people who can dance like this? My judges for tonight include some fairly seasoned swing dancers that really know what they're doing. There is Linda, Michelle, Andre, Mimi, and Jeff. <laughs> Do you see the sweat just trickling down my face just all of a sudden? This is beautiful though, I mean like, they don't dance like that no more. I quickly make friends with the important people in the room. It turns out that most of them have been dancing for close to a decade. Nine years, nine years, it, nine years, and four years. Okay, I love it, I love it. Michelle teaches me how to lead. She explains that it's like dancing with a barrel full of water. with his body, but the arms are, are stiff. But if they would like relax, then you could feel what his body's doing, and then you can do it with him. Mimi and Jeff reinforce basics, following up on what Jenny and Morgan taught me. Rock, step, trip, step, trip, step. Yeah. 
That's the one thing I got. Awesome. That's actually uh, most of what you're going to need. This is the first time I saw him tonight, and uh, I, can, uh, I can feel that he has the potential. All of the judges took time to dance with me. The first thing, because to me it's the most important thing about dancing, I want to see that he's having a good time. I want to see that he's giving his partner enough direction so that she can do what he wants her to do. Knowing all the steps isn't the most important thing. It's more that he's having a good time and that it looks like it's fun and easy. He's a natural dancer. He's fun. Yeah. I mean, he just like picks it up. He was off time a little bit. Sometimes I just wanted to tell him, oh, just stop and just listen to the music again. In Lindy Hop, rhythm is king. It doesn't matter, really, if you can do the basic moves, as long as you can keep that rhythm still going. One of the newbiest moves that I see are when dancers start dancing up here. We call these T-Rex arms. That's not exactly what we should be shooting for. I'm just noticing that there are a lot of couples on this floor who have met through swing dancing, and I think it's really cool. Swing dancing is such a friendly dance, and it really brings people together from around the world. From everything I've seen and heard tonight, swing dancing is a very social art form. Yes, you have to keep rhythm and know some basic moves. But one of the most important skills to hone is to observe what's happening around you, especially with your partner. It's all about ad-libbing off the energy in the dance and the people. I think I'm ready. <laughs> and so it begins. Morgan takes the lead. No, wait, I take the lead. I keep in mind the criteria I will be judged on. Lead and follow, pulse, Rock step, triple step, send out, serve the cookies, side pass, don't forget to check your watch, and of course, improvising and having fun. He's already just rocking out, just hearing the music and letting it move him. He told me it's actually a personal challenge for himself because he loves dancing, but he's avoided social dancing with partners. And that's a huge thing to do. So, after all my blood, sweat, and tears, I'm learning practicing and performing within just seven days, I'm curious to find out my score. Okay, I got a seven, an eight, a 10, thank you, another eight, and a nine. Punch those numbers, carry the one. That comes to 8.4 out of a perfect 10. And I am happy I can live with that, I like that. Week of dancing, I think Aaron did really well. He has musicality, he has rhythm. It's very rare to see someone after only dancing a week that invents stuff on the spot. When he came here tonight, he had changed completely. Like from a whole week of like practicing, of listening to music, of dancing with other people, he was doing things that we didn't even tell him to do because he let himself relax and enjoy the music and the dancing. And that's wonderful. That's what it's all about. It was an absolutely awesome night swing dancing, uh, seven days, and I think I did a pretty good job. Uh, if you ever get the opportunity to go out and swing dance, I suggest you take advantage because it is absolutely amazing. So swing dancing, check. Can't wait to see what the next challenge is going to be. Have a good night. Yeah!
Bye.